Hey everyone, today we are going to solve the little code question, destination city. Okay, so let me explain with this example. So we know that uh, we have the same number of start cities and end cities. So I thought uh, if I create a group of start cities and end cities, so we can use subtraction. So we use a set to create a groups, and the start group and the end group should be like start equal uh, b, d, and c, right? And the uh, end group should be c and b and a, right? So then subtract end minus start. So which means uh, remove uh, common cities in, in the end group. So common city is so C and the start city has also C and uh, B and B, right? So remove C and B. And so in the end, so end group has only A. So that's why uh, we should return A. So we are sure that so there is no A in the start group. So yeah, A is definitely a destination city. So that is a basic idea to solve this question. So with that being said, let's get into the code. Okay, so let's write the code. First of all, uh, create a start cities and end cities. And uh, so we have to create a set of um, cities, right? Start city and end city. So we can do like this. So we use map and we use set and the target list is pass. And we can do like this. So zip and asterisk pass. So asterisk pass create uh, each start city list and uh, end city list. And then uh, we apply set to both lists. So now start city and uh, end city has like a set of city. And then um, destination equal, so we use uh, like a subtraction, and cities minus start cities. And then, so we pop remaining uh, cities. And then after that, return uh, destination. Yeah, so let me submit it. Yeah, looks good. And the time complexity of this solution should be order of n. So where n is number of paths or number of city. And the space complexity is also order of n because uh, in the end, uh, so we store all cities uh, in the like, start city and end city. So that's why. This is a step-by-step -step algorithm of my solution code. Yeah, so that's all I have for you today. If you like it, please subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, or leave a comment. I'll see you in the next question.